Welcome to Customized Trading's presentation of Visual Chart-Based Trading makes trading much easier for the trader. A very effective tool. We want to get started today by covering some of the things that it can do for you. First off, would you like to be able to have the abilities on your trading chart to be able to buy directly from your chart or sell short directly from your chart? Scale into trades with multiple manual entries while using automated strategy exits so you can intermix the discretionary piece with the automated piece or scale out of any automated strategy trade using multiple manual exits so now you can do it the opposite way as well have an automated entry system and you can scale out manually or have an automated exit as well but you can scale in or out and work in unison with the automated strategy or you can manually drag a profit target line into position or manually drag a stop loss line into position. These are all very powerful things you can do right from your charts without ever leaving your trading charts. It doesn't make sense to have to switch over to some order entry where you have to type what the order is on an order bar to make your entries. And the main thing is that you can do all of this without getting an out of sync error between the strategies and the trade manager. The Trendline Trader strategy completely allows a trader to manually interact and manage any existing automated trading strategies while eliminating the common trade manager out of sync error problems. That's vital. Using the tr TL Trader strategy, you can do any of the following directly from your charts. The trader can make the manual entries and exits and then have the computer do specific trade monitoring and alerts or the trader makes the manual entries and the computer takes care of the automated exit side or the computer does the entries and the trader moves the profit exit line and stop exit line to manage the strategies or the computer does both the automated entries and exits and the trader interacts and manages with the automated strategy using the profit exit line and the stop exit line. I guess what we're saying is this gives you the ultimate flexibility of using automation with the human discretion combined in any way that works best for you. This is the power of this add-on strategy and it works on any intraday chart, time frame, and symbol plus works correctly alongside any existing automated strategy you already use. The strategy does require intra-bar order generation to be equal to true to work correctly. This results in the limitation the trade station has that it will not function on a multiple data stream chart. You have to have a single data stream chart. So let's get in and actually look at this process so we can see what it looks like to, to have these various uh, abilities. This first one, there's actually four different things that make up this, um, what we call our visual chart based trading system. The first one allows the trader to make manual trend lines. So let's just enlarge that. This is an example of the British pound US dollar. and It's been an uptrend. And let's just say the trader wanted to be able to draw a line and use manually drawn lines. Well, you go to lines, draw a line, we're going to put a trend line here, and uh, then I'm going to go back and change it back to the arrow. I'm going to duplicate and have a second one. Um, this first one we're going to use to go long in the trade. So I'm going to use a limit order. That's a bright green color. Bright green is a limit buy. Um, bright red is a limit sell. And uh, you can see that it just got into a limit order. Now, if I had already changed this one to yellow, it would have immediately changed to the stop loss but in this case I didn't get it changed so now I changed it to yellow and now I have a stop. So you can see I got into the trade long with a limit order, two contracts and I have a sell stop now in place for that entry. So there's an example of the manual trend lines. Now this next one is using market orders. The fat white line is a market order system. Same concept all I do is change the colors, green buys, red sells, and that one takes you flat, irregardless of the number of contracts. 
So if I click on the green, it's going to buy a contract. Okay, I bought and it automatically puts the line in place. So now the line's there and you just change the color. You don't have to move it around. And it does market orders. And then this becomes your stop loss. And you can move this around on any angle that suits you. It doesn't matter. It's wherever this line crosses the, the last bar on the chart, that's where the price is set at. Now, if you do it multiple times, each time you do it, you're going to have an additional trade. So I change it to green a second time, I get another market order. So I have two. I do it again a third time, and I'll have three trades. Now I have three. Now, if it had made some profit, and you were ready to take profit on one, you just go the reverse. You go red, and it's going to sell the first of those three trades. Now I have two longs. And you can scale out, or you can use, I want out completely, and that goes flat. Now I'm flat in that. Uh, instrument. So that one's a very easy, simple one as well. The third one is more for consolidation breakouts. So let's say, for example, this has been consolidating for a long time instead of just this little one. So then I could basically set that up and say, okay, if it goes through that, which I want to be a stop order, so it's a dark green, and if it goes down through that, I want to be sell short on a stop order. That's a dark red. Again, dark red, dark green are stop orders. And um, uh, that applies to, to uh, this line over here as well as this line. This is just red and green because it's market orders. But stop orders are dark green and dark red. Now we're going to just simulate that by just basically running this up and hitting the chart say that it broke down and we get into a trade when it does that you get into a trade you immediately have your stop so you set your stop again you can use any kind of angling or movement you want it doesn't have to be flat and you're in your short trade with your stop order in place so that's the two different lines uh, for you know breakout patterns, head and shoulders, triangles, you name it, consolidations, uh, or even a trading range. If you have a trading range and you want to like at the top of a Bollinger Band, you can use a limit order to reverse it when it gets up to that point. That's another way you can utilize that one. The last one is the most sophisticated. You can see that these lines tell you the number of contracts that it can do. Now, with $30,000, uh, I can only do one mini uh, or two minis on the short. I could go short two minis. I could go long one mini contract. Um, so, you can use any combination of these lines. Like if I want to do a market order short, it's just the dark or the bright red. And now I'm in a market order short. Now, you'll see that my stop loss is there and I can set it where I want so I'm setting it above the high of that so if it's going to break down and if it breaks down I'm saying well I think it'll come down and challenge into this area here well fine I got it set up I have a, a risk to reward ratio of 3.2 so I'm looking to make three times over three times the profit of what I'm currently risking now as this begins to develop some profit I can begin to cut that risk. I can say, well, you know, it looks like it's going to move. The only question is whether it will break through this area here. Maybe I want to decrease my risk. I'm going to go to the high of that prior bar. Well, now after it calculates, it'll come up and say, now I have a seven uh, times reward to my risk. So I'm risking a small amount. And maybe when it gets down to this area completely, I might actually even move it down a little further. And, and be at a break even. So I've eliminated my risk in the trade. We really appreciate you joining us for this trading webinar. And uh, make sure to tune in to our other uh, many different trading webinars. They're, they're a great source of education. Uh, knowledge is power in the market. And here's our contact information. Thank you.